Decagon devices make sensors that are built to last, but anytime you put electronics out in the environment where they're exposed to the elements, problems can arise. In a complex sensor network, it's imperative to find out where the problem occurs immediately so that you can isolate it, correct it, and keep getting good continuous data. When things go wrong, you need a diagnostic tool to tell you whether or not your Decagon sensors are doing their job. This is the ProCheck. It will let you know whether or not your Decagon device's soil moisture sensors are doing their job. The ProCheck is invaluable as a troubleshooting tool because it either eliminates the sensors as the source of error or it shows you exactly where the problem is. Here's a hypothetical. Let's suppose you have 32 sensors connected to a multiplexer. A couple sensors do not work when you fire it all up. Is the problem with your sensors, the multiplexer, a loose connection somewhere, your program, or the data logger? At this point, you have several troubleshooting options. You can jiggle the connections on all of your sensors and hope you get lucky. And then we get to your program. Do you really want to pour over that 1,000 line monster if you're not sure whether or not that's the actual problem? Or you can plug your sensors into a ProCheck and know whether or not they are the problem. Let's move on to the next scenario, SDI-12. You love it, you hate it, it does a lot for you, but it's not perfect and you know it. You've got 32 sensors connected to a common data line, reading them all in SDI-12. You fire up the system and none of them give you any data. One option for troubleshooting this scenario is to unplug each sensor and read the entire network in between unplugging them. Think Christmas tree lights here. If you have one sensor that has a short in it, it can interfere with communications over the entire network. You have to find that one or more sensor immediately and get it off the data line. One option is to unplug each sensor individually and hope that the network comes up with that sensor unplugged and pray that there's only one sensor down on that network. Or you can use the ProCheck to test your sensors and find out exactly where the problem sensors are. In the context of a large sensor network, the cost of a ProCheck is minuscule compared to the time that it will save you keeping your network running and getting you the data that you need.